New Concepts of Memory and a First-Person Approach by the Memory Group in Psych 352. We will now be looking at Endel Tolving in regards to his new concepts of memory. Rather than simply looking at episodic memory, he felt one also had to look at semantic memory as well. Episodic memory is more autobiographical. While semantic memory deals more with knowledge of the world. In Elements of Episodic Memory, Tolvin defined episodic and semantic in the memory system as opposed to previously being defined as terms that distinguished between memory tasks. Furthermore, he also proposed a distinction between two kinds of consciousness. The first is autonoetic consciousness, such as self-knowing, defining property of episodic memory, and it is like a mental time travel or remembering. The second is noetic consciousness, such as intuition or simply knowing something. Throughout his work, Tolvin used remembering to refer to autonoetic consciousness and knowing to refer to noetic consciousness. Remembering versus knowing. In his recognition studies, he used the words remembering as an example of consciously recollecting something experienced at the time that word was studied. And knowing would simply be recognizing the word on some other basis. In regards to remembering, one might see the word president. They might think to themselves, Yesterday, I associated this word with minister. Today, I remember that association. Another example would be if one saw the word harp. One might think to themselves, on Friday, I was in a restaurant with a harpist. I remember thinking of that yesterday. An example of knowing would be if one saw the word gun and might just think to themselves, I just knew that it was that. Or one might look at the word butterfly and think, it was just one of those words that rang a bell. Tolvin was also able to show that his subjects could understand the distinction between the two kinds of awareness and could report them by using remember and know responses. Such responses would be something like yes, I remember or no after each yes and no response during the recognition test. Tolvin argued that episodic memories are vastly different from the other bits of information we tend to hold on to, such as the semantic memories. After a while, his detractors could no longer argue back, and his work laid the foundation for the important field of memory research.